Convicted killer Juan Edward Castillo was executed tonight. The San Antonio man was convicted of shooting and killing a teenager during a robbery more than 14 years ago. As Castillo was executed, his victim's family feeling a sense of closure and justice. The night team's Patty Santos tells us more about Castillo's last day and his last message before his death. Patty? Yeah, his final words were to thank everyone who has stood by him, telling them he will see them on the other side. But Castillo never apologized for killing Tommy Garcia Jr. Five members of the 19-year-old victim's family witnessed the execution in Huntsville. No one from Castillo's family was at the execution, but officials say they did visit him earlier in the day. Now, while the execution was going on, Garcia's family here in San Antonio held a balloon release to mark their day of justice. The lethal injection took 23 minutes to kill Castillo. Garcia's family waited so long, they say they have a weight that has been lifted from their shoulders. It was a difficult day for me and my family. Uh, glad that justice was served today. Uh, it was a day with a lot of different emotions, so uh, glad that it's all behind us and glad that um, this is over with and we can all move forward. I'm sorry, not for him, for, for his family, his mother, you know, because I'm a mother, you know. And I feel that he got what he deserved, and I'm sorry for that. I can't forgive him. I'm not God. I can never forgive him. Castillo's execution date had been postponed three times. Now, during a 2005 trial, testimony showed Castillo's set up Garcia by luring him with drugs and sex. Now, when Garcia refused to hand over his cash, he was shot and killed. Three other people also involved in this were convicted and received presents, prison sentences for their involvement in the murder. This is the sixth execution in Texas so far, and another six are scheduled. Patty Santos, KSAT 12 News.